I will remind you of the conversation we had right on this program with my sister Miki Addison when the world tries to cause us to misunderstand and misinterpret compassion. That would want to move us merely to empathy, just feeling, sit where I sit, be where I am, identify with me. That's not the call of the Christ follower. We are called to a higher ethos. The call to compassion leads us to do something about the condition. When we see these things happening as they are, when we see Democrats and Republicans running headlong towards sexual rebellion, when we see the populace all over the country voting affirmatively, very similar to give us Barabbas, where people are saying, let us kill our babies. What is being revealed is that America ain't heaven, it's the harvest field. Eternal-based, biblically anchored compassion moves us to do something. If we are believers, we cannot be comfortable going day in, day out, day in, day out, day in, day out, neighbors unsaved, co-workers unsaved, people around us unsaved, and we're not moved or affected by that in any degree. Even worse, we become calcified in our relationship with Christ and almost have a sinful disdain to, well, we won't say it with our words, but our actions, or dare I say inaction, reveals that we and I don't even care if people are literally on their way to hell. Tune in to the Hamilton Corner, weekdays at 5 p.m. Central on American Family Radio.